Hey everyone, welcome to Building a Home Studio. So in this class, we're going to talk about different kinds of studios. I'm gonna show you around my place, and then I'm gonna walk you through everything that you need to know in order to set up something that uh, is gonna be really functional for you. It's gonna have everything you need to produce music. Um, it's gonna have everything you need to record music. And we're even gonna go into quite a bit about acoustic treatment to make your room sound really good. Um, we're gonna start off talking about computers, what kind of computer you should get, what, how fast it needs to be um, to be running everything that we need. Then we're gonna go into software, what you should consider buying for software. And as I walk through all this stuff that you're gonna need to buy, I'm really focusing on keeping it inexpensive. So I'm not gonna tell you to buy a bunch of stuff you don't need. I'm gonna focus on what are the essentials that you can start off with to have a great home studio and then build on later. After uh, software, we're gonna talk about more hardware. We're gonna talk about speakers, what you should look for when you're buying speakers, audio interfaces, headphones, mixers, keyboards, all that good stuff. Then we're gonna get into acoustics and then we're gonna walk through kind of an architectural drawing of your room and where you should put everything and how to set everything up. What gets wired to what? Uh, what's the best way to configure your audio system in your room to get the best results? Then we're gonna talk about recording setup, what you should have for mics, what you need to buy right away and what can be added later, uh, and then some other miscellaneous hardware stuff. So it's a great class. I had a lot of fun making it. Uh, I hope you enjoy it. I hope that you take this class and at the end of the class, you have a nice, beautiful room to set up and record and produce music in. Cool, so join me now, let's dive in and let's make you a great room to make music. Here's the definitive conclusion of me. Okay, so my opinion, it's a highly opinionated answer, but here's what I'm gonna tell you. You ready? It doesn't matter. Um, get whichever you're more comfortable with. I'm RX program can be really, really useful. This is a noise reduction audio cleanup program. Um, you know, you can see here just some of the settings, de-hum, de-clip, de-click. Um, here's what you wanna look for. You don't wanna look for speakers. That's not what you want. You wanna look for studio monitors. Okay, that's what we call these kinds of speakers. They might also be called near field studio monitors. That means we're gonna be sitting fairly close. So we want our speakers not right up against the wall. That's bad for acoustics. Okay, we don't want them there. We want them forward. We want them really kind of in line with our desk. Keep our power cables and our video, or our audio cables separated. Okay, so for instance, standard, the old safety, the standard that everybody uses and everybody loves is a Shure SM57. That's this thing, okay? Or uh, an alternative would be an SM58. That's this one. Okay. 